Okay, I'm JavaScript Algos and Data Structures. We're doing basic JavaScript course on challenge 106 of 113. So today we're going to generate random whole numbers with JavaScript. So just like in the last challenge, if you saw that video, uh, we can use math.random to generate a random decimal. We can multiply that random decimal by another value, whatever range essentially we want the random number to be within and then we can use math.4 to round it down to the nearest whole number um, so yeah you can also use math.seal if you want to round it up but we're gonna round down for this example and yeah uh, so this is a pretty simple concept you get a random decimal multiply it by another number to get whatever range you want so 20 to get a range of 0 and 19 and then use math.4 to round it down Okay, so looks like this. As you can see, that's kind of the syntax we're going to use. Uh, and we're going to use this technique to generate a random whole number between 0 and 9. So we can simply say uh, let rand equal, if we just take this guy out here, let's return rand. That's going to be our random number. And math.random times 10, because it is exclusive of the uh, number. So it'll be 0 through 9 for this case. Same thing if we use 20, it'll be 0 through 19. Uh, if we wanted to do 0 through, or I'm sorry, 1 through 20, you could just add 1 to the result, or you could just do 0 through 20 as by, multiply by 21. Or if we wanted to do 0 through 10, we could multiply by 11, just do it the same way. But we just want to go through zero, 0 through 9, so we'll do that. So this will give us, um, if we console.log rand, as you can see, we now have a number that is going to be between 0 and 9. Um, and then we're going to use math.4 to round it down to the nearest whole number. Now we have eight. So if we run the code, you'll see it runs it a couple times, and we're getting whole numbers here that are between zero and nine. So that's all we have to do for this one. Math that random, definitely a useful function. Math that four, math that seal. Those are definitely ones you're going to see uh, and definitely have to use just to create randomness in different little projects and things you may create. All right. So hope that helped. Hope to see you guys in the next challenge.